Good morning, Colorado. Welcome to our Thursday edition of Local Biz Buzz. I'm your host, Larry Hers, and today in studio, I have Bridget and Tom from my hometown, Huntington, Long Island, in the studio. Of course, they don't live there now. With the John and Chocolate Chip Company. Welcome, you two. Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks for having us. So I think I reached out to you guys. I saw these, and I've been seeing these on Instagram from all these other cities. Like everybody's holding up this giant cookie. Mm -hmm. I'm like, why don't we have giant cookies? And then you all of a sudden appeared. I'm like, you're coming on the show, and you're like, well, we just started. Right. Right. <laughs> That's okay with us. Yeah. Uh, who's gonna give me a little history of you guys? Uh, yeah, I'll start. Yeah. So uh, this company kind of launched we in uh, during the, like the midst of the pandemic and everything. We just kind of baking, having fun. Came across this recipe, kind of modified it a little bit. When you say came across, what does that mean? Where did it come We've from? We've been so, messing around yeah. baking for, she's awesome in the kitchen. She went to okay. school for culinary and everything. And just kind of having fun making cookies and just whipped up these and they came out awesome. It was really just for us. And yeah. then one day I'm like, try this cookie. And he's like, oh my gosh, this is amazing. I'm like, all right, like, we had something. do you want to do something with this? Do you what was the serious? first cookie? What it was, was our signature, signature. Yeah, just the signature. chocolate chip cookie. It was just yeah. semi-sweet chips and our signature batter and it just kind of exploded from there and we yeah. shared it with family and friends, um, shipping them across the country because during the holiday season, you know, you ship your cookies when you bake for the holidays. We're like, oh, we can do that. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, it exploded from there. We got feedback from flavors and everything, but it just stemmed from our love of baking and cookies and being in the kitchen together, really. Yeah. So, no, that's um, big. And who so, doesn't yeah. like a cookie? I know. You know. That's like the whole thing. <laughs> we say, giant cookies, giant smile. That is our slogan. That's pretty good cookie. right there. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Well, let's show them off all your cookies here on this close-up over here and see all the different flavors you got. Start with this guy right here. And this is how everybody does it on Instagram. I'm like, right. I'm like, I don't understand why you have to, but that's the shot, right? Right, yeah. right. Yeah. And each cookie is five and a half ounces, so it is a hefty cookie there. That is our signature giant chocolate chip cookie. Um, right, again with the semi-sweet chips. You see how nice and ooey gooey, <laughs> super oh, yeah. soft, um, and of course giant. Right? Yeah. Who likes a hard cookie? I don't understand that no. yeah. cookie thing. I'm sorry. I don't, no idea. I don't either. All right, should I should I chop? Should I use yeah. the knife? Go ahead. Yeah, go yeah. for it. That is our the s'more the merrier cookie right, right. there. Ooh. So yeah. again, <laughs> our signature base with some gooey marshmallows, graham cracker, um, Hershey's bar, and all mixed in. For that gooey campfire cookie, I guess you could so say. So you're recommending, right, that, that people warm up your cookies? We highly yeah. recommend. Um, yeah. A lot of people just enjoy them right out of our packaging. This is how they do come. The walnut um, chip. Individually wrapped, so you can stick them in your freezer um, if you order a whole batch of them. But again, it keeps it really fresh, but mm -hmm. warmed right out of the bag. How um, long? Both delicious. So about 10 to 15 seconds in the microwave, or you can warm them up with the oven. Um, and that is our walnut chip cookie. So nice we thought to, flavor. yes, one of our classic flavors. Um, either you love nuts in your cookie or you don't. So we yeah, want to give people that option. Thing, yeah. Yeah. yeah, no, it's funny. So, yes. This is probably my favorite cookie. This is the Florida Sol. And it's just like those little um, flaky sea salt coming from the Mediterranean. It adds like a nice little texture to it. The salty and sweet, I feel like you just can't get enough of it. It's that perfect balance. Yeah. It's like, and yeah, you have to use that salt when you're doing salt Yeah, if cookies. you're going to do, right. do it right. You're not going to use iodized. Yeah, no, yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and kosher really doesn't work either. No, no. no. Yeah, it's a nice little crisp. Great ratio. Crisp. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sweet yeah. and salty. And this is our newest addition. This is the chocolate peanut butter crunch. So we have like little honey roasted peanuts that we make, uh, put it on inside and also on the top, as you can see. On the inside too, there's like a little uh, peanut butter patty we kind of make as well, just to add a little extra peanut butter flavor in there. Super tasty, a little too layered. Right, and the chocolate um, cookie bottom and that's a peanut butter batter on top. So mm -hmm. that combination. So yes, we have five flavors now. Always looking to expand, get feedback from um, our customers, but What's, yeah. what's the next flavor in the works? Oh my gosh. We, we have, have a ton a of, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Snickerdoodle. Actually, surprisingly not. We're thinking oh, of a cinnamon funny. roll maybe. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe. I like <laughs> no anything mint. No promises, but so okay. chocolate chip right. mint. For you, maybe we'll keep something yeah, in mind. Yeah. yeah. Okay, we can do something like that. <laughs> you can call the and eats cookie. Yeah, hey. Yeah, okay. <laughs> That's, mm. Might not be like bad for no. a collab right there. Yeah, I wouldn't be opposed. Chocolatey, yeah, that sounds good. Yeah. Okay. How much do your cookies cost? Uh, so it depends on the pack you get. It could be um, each cookie comes out to about five five dollars or so, 
if you the more you order, usually the bigger discount Volume you get. Discount. Yeah, and then mm -hmm. we've had a lot of people order for hospitals, um, so they they'll order almost 100 cookies and they just bring it in, so they get a big discount. Um, and it's really just like if you, even if you want a little three pack too, you can just try out a couple different flavors, see which one works. And what we see is a big trend is people will start out with three. Next time they order, it's going to be six, twelve, whatever it might be. You know, and I totally understand new company, just want to try out the flavors, try out our cookies, and then from there they decide to go big, just like yeah. our cookies. And we ship nationwide, <laughs> um, that's actually why we started up, so um, we're licensed to ship across the country, and we're very proud to speak for that too, so we can mm -hmm. share our cookies really across across the country, great which is gift, awesome. Great for gifts. Exactly. Oh, exactly. Yep, yep. Um, free shipping with a minimum order? Or? Um, not yet, since okay. we are new, so... Um, hopefully in the future, but right now it just varies depending on your zone. Um, yeah. And for people in the metro area, how, they, how do they get yep. the, We We offer local pickup, um, and if you go on our website too, once you place your order, click local pickup, the uh, address will pop right up on there, right on the other side of Denver from here. Um, and we, we bake, do... Yeah, we bake out of a shared kitchen right now. Yeah. So we don't have a brick and mortar storefront at the moment. Sure. Um, a commercial new, kitchen? A commercial yep. kitchen, okay. yeah, yeah. So you can pick up at that location on Sundays. So we do bake once a week right now, um, every Sunday, and then your order will, order will be shipped out Monday morning. Or if you pick up, we uh, pick up Sunday this afternoon. Any local delivery? Not yet. Not yet. So that's we were that thinking we're, about yeah, it. Yeah, we get yeah that I think that's going to be big. Yeah, that just, might be next for Yeah, we're sure. just trying to get everything mm -hmm. going as well as we can. Yeah. It seems like people who do what you do do the local delivery, which seems like yeah. a nightmare. Yeah. I don't understand. Yeah, yeah. You, they charge yeah. for it, I right. think. Yeah, you but, might. Yeah, charge but no, the pickup seems the way to go. Yeah. Sure. What is the website? GiantChocolateChipCookies.com. That's Pretty amazing much. that that yeah. was available. Oh, yeah. yes. We oh, just yeah. thought, like, who could forget that name, right? So yeah. Giant Chocolate Chip Cookies <laughs> is our product. That's what we you know, speak about all the time. And same with our Instagram. It's at Giant Chocolate Chip Cookies. So. Yeah. Yes. All right. What did we forget? I believe that's all, right? All right. I think so. Oh, the, the eating yeah. part, the best part of the show. Oh, yes, please. Dive in. <laughs> Which one should I go for? Wait, you're going to be surprised. Your I'm name. actually... <laughs> yeah, that's been our top seller lately. I know, that's my weeks. current favorite. It changes, right? I mean, you just but. don't see that every day. No. And, and I'm an ooey gooey guy. Yeah. Like, that, is, that is what a cookie should be. Of course, I don't think I could eat a whole one of these. Exactly. We well, definitely recommend I say that sharing, all the time, right? but I eat, I eat a whole one. I so. I'd be high as a kite. I'd be bouncing off the walls. Yeah, right. <laughs> Pleasure to meet you yeah, two. Yeah, yeah, no, Representing yeah, Huntington. Yeah. It's not a big town where we're from. I mean, on Long Island, North Shore, about an hour outside of the city. Yeah. Which yeah. we just found out just this morning that yeah. we were from yeah. the same town. So small it's world. Great. <laughs> yeah. I have a stupid saying, but small world, yeah. but I wouldn't want to paint it. Uh, True. Yeah. Good point. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Pretty deep right there. Uh, so <laughs> nice to meet you too. Yeah, I'll you have as a well. this in a second. Thanks for having us. Uh, 11.30 a day on What's for Lunch, we have uh, Jersey Street Cafe, which is founded by Jimmy Lombatis. He is a legend. He's the guy who started Quiznos. Hmm. And now he's got a restaurant called Jersey Street Cafe. <laughs> So uh, we'll see you then. Let's eat. Awesome. Oh, oh, whoa. <laughs> oh.